Hello everyone, this is Luna the Moon Tarot. So today let's see what are your person's energies towards your connection, uh, their, this connection with you. So quickly let's do an energy update right now. So this is for my viewers. An energy update, what are the current thoughts and feelings? Let's see, what are the current points and feelings? Current thoughts and feelings, please. This is the energy update. Current thoughts and feelings, please. Okay. Current thoughts and feelings, please. This is the current thoughts and feelings. Current thoughts and feelings. Current energy updates, please. Magician, Six of Cups. Let's see what else comes out. Current thoughts and feelings, please. Let's see. We have Knight of Swords. We have Four of Wands. Nice. We have the Moon. We have Nine of so Sorry, Ten of Swords. Two of Swords. What else? Okay, Five of Wands. What else? Five of Wands, Nine of Cups, then we have Justice, we have the High Priestess, we have the Knight of Cups, we have Six of, sorry, Seven of Cups, we have Page of Cups as well. On the deck we have the Chariot. Alright, so your person is manifesting you okay they know that this connection is too good to be true and i see some or the other form of communication is coming towards you but then be careful because you know your person can get a little ex you know aggressive in case if you try to poke into a lot of many things and if you try to argue or give an explanation or ask for an explanation with the magician card i see that uh, your person is definitely manifesting and they know that this is this connection is too good to be true they definitely uh, you know try to move on from you in the past but they couldn't okay they are still guarded they are still wounded they are still sad and they for few of you i'm hearing they have still uh, kept you blocked or they have blocked their heart they are not ready to come out of their comfort zone but they are still hopeful can be dealing with an aquarian here they are sad about how this connection uh, you know is going or has gone in the past because i see backstabbing can be from past i see challenges conflicts again i see that uh, that is uh, with you but then at the bottom of the deck i would say that with the chariot i see that they are trying to find a direction because uh, they are still wounded they are still guarded they are feeling sad about something that has happened with you in the past in this connection and they are very guarded they have kind of pull uh, you know um, they have 
kind of build up a huge wall so that you are not able to break through it okay i also feel that uh, you know uh that uh, few few i hear that they may have blocked you as well and they have still kept you on blocked and they are not ready to come out of their comfort zone but they are somewhere down the line healing they are trying to balance their life they are still hopeful and with page of wands that i see at the bottom of the deck i feel that there is some kind of communication that is going to get established in case if it hasn't it will with knight of swords and with six of cups i feel that you know they are still in your memories they haven't gotten they haven't moved on or they haven't got over with your memories because right now we are in the shadow period of mercury retrograde so whatever past uh, moments or feelings that you guys had together they are still revisiting it okay they are still revisiting it and it is coming to the surface and by 9th of september once the mercury is completely into retrograde position they will feel those uh, vibrations even more okay they will think about past and past people will also resurface in your life with knight of swords i feel that they want to speak to you but there is some kind of clarification or justification they may ask from you or they may give you and it in case if you are going to poke them much or if they are, they are going to poke you much you guys may get aggressive with each other so be very careful while talking to them okay this is a guidance and a warning for you they are definitely thinking about uh, how life will be in case if they commit to you or get married to you for few of them i see that they are planning planning to buy a house or do some kind of large investment or a car something of that sort but for most of you i feel that they are definitely thinking about stabilizing you know uh, about stability about getting married about getting uh, whether you are the right person for them or not because they have lot of anxiety and um uh, fear around this connection that's something that i feel but they their intuitions are running really high they may be even seeing you in their dreams okay while sleeping at night they somehow carry a lot of backstabbing energy from their past relationship which is actually uh which may be you know there, there is a possibility that they are also projecting that in this particular relationship as well with two of swords i feel that they are unable to decide and somewhere down the line they are still blindfolded it is like they are not ready to accept that they are in love with you or they are uh, they have you in their life it is more about uh, you know they don't want to see how this connection is or how beautiful this connection is because they had manifested in their subconscious mind somebody like you and a connection like you okay but then now when it is there they are acting as if they don't know they can't see you they can't see this connection okay so they are just thinking about it they are indecisive if they want they can accept the reality they can take off the blindfold and they will be able to see clearly how beautiful this connection is but then they are denying they are denying to accept it because i also feel that in the recent past you guys may have got into some kind of conflicts drama jealousy possessiveness uh difference of opinion because of which they you, you know they kind of took a step back or probably they created a scenario because of their past uh because of their past relationship and they felt that, that betrayal and all that stuff they created a situation wherein you guys actually fought because they were not clear in their mind and they were confused in their mind because we have seven of cups so i feel that this person is definitely confused and have a fear or or phobia of committing however saying uh, having said that i also feel that you know this person is emotionally they feel very satisfied and connected with you whenever you are around they have certain calmness you know their emotions are not running high up and down okay they have certain stability in their mind and they do have marriage on their mind again and again they are trying to balance this their life this connection for few of you i also feel that your person may be engrossed right now in some kind of legal matters and for minority i feel that they can be uh, somebody who is going through a divorce and legal matters or something like that okay but mostly i see that this can be a karmic connection which has come into your life to give you lessons okay to teach you lessons
with high priestess i also feel that one of you is getting too much into spirituality watching tarot videos learning tarot uh, or astrology keeping secrets and praying too much intuitively manifesting meditating okay so high priestess is always uh, somewhere down the line i i connected with occult astrology intuitions hidden secrets mysteries okay so they know that you know you are somebody who is very mysterious you have some mysterious aura around you however they want to come forward but they are going to be very slow because of because knight of clubs it, cups is a very slow moving card okay very slow moving energy this person wants to come forward and wants to offer you a cup of love but then they are uh, again you know in two minds whether to come forward or not they also wants to come forward and offer you an apology okay and i see there can be two energies that you may be dealing with page of cups and knight of cups one energy which is very emotional and one energy which is quite in and out in this connection your person is definitely trying to find a direction here okay let's see what else what is the outcome what else what else what is the outcome for now okay i see stuck energy again nine of swords which means that your person is still stuck they are not able to move on they know that you are somebody who's financially abundant you're single and uh, you're somebody who can take good care of yourself uh, you're somebody who's financially quite stable independent and i also see that your person is uh, knows that you're financially quite uh, well off for few of you i feel okay otherwise for for majority i also feel that your person wants to stay single for now and focus on finances because there can be some challenges that they might be facing when it comes to their finances okay so they wants to improve that and that is also one of the reason that they are holding themselves back with knight of pentacles again i had uh, we have knight of cups and pentacles again two energies this person is going to take long in case if you're looking for a commitment or a relationship this person is definitely going to be very slow but they are definitely thinking about marriage what else could you ask for the lovers soulmate connection karmic connection for few of you soulmate connection for very few of you they want to work towards this particular connection equally and we have 10 of cups and four of wands and the lovers i mean it's just a beautiful it's it's a beautiful spread okay your person is now coming forward and willing to work on this connection with you equal give and take balance balance okay emotional satisfaction marriage stability family life again stability marriage proposal again marriage stability equilibrium again three of pentacles equal give and take okay so few of you i feel that uh, you know guys i feel that your person is coming forward with some clarity i see slowly and gradually their thought process is changing in this connection because just 3 4 days back we were at a very bad stage now things are progressing if you see now the things are progressing they are slow undoubtedly but they are progressing okay towards a uh, higher level of commitment slow steady wins the race always remember have patience keep patience otherwise you're going to spoil this connection in case if this reading resonates with you just be slow and steady let entire september and mid of october pass okay what are the messages what are the messages what are the messages please okay we have my family is very judgmental of us being together i love our intimacy okay i'm trying hard to balance my life do you miss me they want to know whether you miss them or not they are trying really hard to balance their life without you i will be with you before you realize and they know that they will be with you they haven't moved on they don't intend to move on my friends say i blush when your name comes up they are talking with their friends they are discussing as well and probably their friends tease them as well with your name okay only you know me inside out and at the bottom of the deck i miss you of course they do we 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 make a good couple okay they think of you as a good couple i am working hard for our future and i have trust issues of course they do all right guys that's about it thank you so much take care